Scrub and Dub Dub, what's in the tub? What's going on, my scrub subscribers? Ace here, and I am here with some more Pokemon Y Wonderlock for you guys. And if you guys are excited, make sure to hit that like button down below. But yeah, hey, what's poppin', everybody? Let me uh, let me get let me get on the internet so that we can actually you know like start off Wonderlock correctly, where I'm on the internet and I'm able to trade in case I get a Pokemon. Um, but I don't realistically think I will be able to get one. But yeah, let me review really quick. So if you guys missed the last episode, we actually got to this point where we're in front of the fairy gym. And, uh, we can't actually do much because, uh, well, you can only fight the fairy gym because we can't trigger any events. And nothing basically opens up until you beat the fairy gym. So, we are here at the nice fairy gym. Looking kind of nice over here. Looking kind of nice. And, uh, we have our squad here. Young Crobat leading the squad because we are going to the fairy type gym. And he is a poison type, of course. Or she actually is a poison type, of course. You know, like, I, like, I noticed the other day that, like, half my team is girls. And, like, the girls do hella work. So, hashtag girl power. It's probably going to be the name of the episode. But, yeah. <laughs> Either way. Uh, you know. And, uh, acrobatics, bite, fly, and poison fang is what Crobat, the nice late, the nice purple lady is rocking over here, okay? You know, I'm saying With nice inner focus. So, none of these, uh, none of these fake outs out here think they can, they think they can, they can stop Crobat? <laughs> Boy. Girl. Alright. Either way. Moving on. We have our young. Whoa, ta -ta. The Blastoise with Bite, Surf, Protect, and Water Pulse with the Young Torrent ability. So if we do get down to that red, in the nice clutch situations, we can blow somebody away with a nice Surf. Or a Water Pulse, either way. You know, if we get that Mega, we can get that Mega Launcher Boost. Boy, Blastoise gonna go more the extension. <laughs> but either way, moving on. Now, this is kind of our backup today for uh, Crobat. Because Crobat, Crobat's a, a strong girl out here, but she's not trying to face off, you know, against, like, Electric types or, like, Psychic types or, like, Mr. Mime. That's not, that's not a great matchup. Well, actually, you probably get blown away by an acrobatics, but still. Laron is our good backup here because he kind of just like eats up everything because he has that nice look at look at that look at that physical defense right there. All right, you know what I'm saying? Even with a like a lowering nature, boy. And he has the sturdy, so or she has the sturdy. Excuse me, young Stalania has the sturdy, and she's gonna blow away everybody. All right, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. Moving on, we have Jolteon here with a quick attack, bite, thunder wave, and thunderbolt. Now you guys determined what this mod was going to be, and this thing actually came in clutch. Uh, nice Jolteon claim it clutch in uh, Clement's gym, the electric gym, and we got thunderbolt as a reward there. So thunderbolt is rocking on Jolteon. Next we have probably probably the highlight of the team right now because this thing makes me smile so much. The swift screeching agility, double slapping, a palm. Ah, I love Apom. You guys don't understand my fascination with Apom, but it's purple. It's amazing. It has a little little paw hand on the on its tail, and it's it's so cute. Ah, all right. <laughs> but either way, next we have Mawile, the taunting, biting, fair winding, astonishing beast out here, and uh, it has it's rocking intimidate. So you know it's gonna gonna intimidate our foes into some fear as we blow them away. True. Alright, but, but either way. Um, yeah, these two right here are kind of lower leveled. Uh, as you see, 1 and 20. As compared to, like, Jolteon, Laron, Blastoise, like, up in, like, towards 40 levels. All the cries right there. But, uh, yeah, uh, those two are probably gonna get... I have the experience share on, so they will gain some levels today. Uh, hopefully. Well, yeah, no, they will, because I'll be battling people. I'm gonna battle, like, everybody in the gym. But, yeah, before I waste too much time, let's, uh, let's get into it. So, I'm gonna go over here, because I feel like... I don't know, I feel like left is the way to go. All right, we're in the fan room. True. Uh, we could go on these, but I kind of just want to battle. I want to battle everybody because free experience for our lower level mods. Plus, we have a poison type and a steel type, so I'm not really worried about what she's doing. You know what I'm saying? The shoddy girl, Kylie. She has a Dedene. Great. Uh, that's not good for us, actually. Because Crobat doesn't like electric types. I don't want to get, like, discharged or... Fucking Thunderbolts. So I'm gonna go into Laron here. Young Stalania. Come out here, girl. Girl power. Alright, what you got? A Volt Switch. Okay. Ooh, okay. Note to self, Stalania does not like electric moves that much. Azumarill? Oh, she pro played me. She pro played, like, she pro played the fuck out of me. Alright. Because Azumarill, like, Azumarill blows away Laron, to be honest. Like, even with my physical defense. Well, I'm probably going to catch a Bubble Beam here. That's why I'm going to the Blastoise. Because this is in-game. Rain Dance. Hello. Okay. I'll play with you. Alright. Blastoise will blow you away. Alright. Know what I'm saying? 
Why am I playing this like a competitive Wi-Fi battle with like double switches? Hello? Alright, catch us through. Aqua Ring. This is kind of rude. Because she's, she's going to be gaining HP every turn. This is annoying. Don't play rough me. That rainbow double edge, hello? Azumarill, chill. Okay, she doesn't have huge power. Because I would have done a lot more. Actually, wait. No, with the, no, no, she's definitely not huge power. What is the other? Oh, Sap Sipper. Yo. If I had given this thing an attack boost and it double edged me, oh boy. Well, I don't have any grass types on my team, so, you know, either way. But, yeah. Hey, Blastoise getting that, le that nice level. Okay. Uh, the rest of my team. All right, Jolteon. Yo, Jolteon actually walls the hell out of Dene. Yo, Apom about to gain all these levels. All right, three. Another one. Another one. I think he's gonna get to level ten. Sand attack. Uh. Fuck agility, to be honest. Like sand attack is like decently useful, cause then like, if we're in a bad situation, something can't hit me. A level five. Level 6? I'm pretty sure it gets to level 10. Might be 11. Alright, level 7. Another one. Another one. Astonish. Okay, for those ghost types, I feel you. Um... Uh, fuck Swift. We ain't no special attackers out here. Like that nice Astonish? Okay. Level 10. Okay, level 11. Okay, maybe we're, we are getting higher than a level baton pass. Um, we're gonna keep all moves because it's not that useful in game, to be honest. Alright. Mawel wants to learn vice grip. Okay. Uh, forget. Nah, we're good. Yeah. Oh no, oh shit. My bad. Uh,. All right, keep old moves. Give up on learning, yes. Cool, all right, there we go. The Dene, okay, yeah, I need to swap. But uh, let's go into Jolteon. Let's let Jolteon do some work out here. Because what is this thing gonna do to Jolteon, realistically? Nothing, that's right. What's poppin', Dene? You can't touch me, but I can touch you. These Thunderbolts. <laughs> Please hit me with a charge beam. Hello, Snore. Oh, this thing. Wait, oh, it doesn't have. Wait, does it have rest? Please don't have rest. Oh, you motherfucker. Mm. Alright, don't have Chesto Berry, and we're fine. Because, yeah, I can, I can four hit KO you with Thunder Boy, I think. Let me see. Yeah, it looks like four hit KO. Because you need three turns of sleep. This is a mandatory turn of sleep right here. Oh, but you have Snore. Oh, that doesn't do much, to be honest. Dene is not that strong, it's just bad as hell. Yo, if we get a crit, we can 3 hit KO it. It's time. Alright, Jolteon. Do it for the Vuers, alright? Kill this Dene. Right here, you're gonna crit. I guarantee it. <laughs> Oh, oh dog, okay, I was gonna say, please don't rest. Please don't rest. Catch a quick attack. Cause I don't want no weird speed tie cause of levels. Alright, get him out of here. Goodbye, didn't Hey. Alright. Lair on grew to level 38. Crobat. Okay. Apom grew to level 12. About to gain all these levels. Level 13. Level 22. Hey, alright. Nice. So strong. So beautiful. Thank you, my team. My team is composed of some very beautiful girls. And a nice, handsome Jolteon. I'm talking... That's a little weird, alright? I'm not... I'm not... I don't... I don't know them. <laughs> you guys know what I'm talking about. Ow, I just hit my hand on my keyboard. Ow. Uh, but super potions on deck. So let's let everybody heal up a little bit. Hmm, but while we're kind of rolling through this gym a little bit, let me think of a question of the day for you guys. 
Hmm. Okay. Um, like there's a, there's a lot of moments in uh, my life. Well, not a lot of moments, but a, a good a good chunk of moments. I'm gonna go over here because I feel like we came in on the one in the far right. So I feel like we have to go to the one farthest away. Cause it's like Sabrina's gym. If you go to the one farthest away. Okay. I looked up to Valor so much that I came here to learn from her. Okay. Yeah. But uh, back to the point. So question of the day. Uh, well, there's been a lot of times in my life, yo, passerby Kaylin, you need to chill, all right? <laughs> but uh, there's been a lot of times in my life where I've been pretty proud of myself, like in that, like I've accomplished something really good, you know? Uh, like I've done a lot of great things with wrestling. I've done, you know, I've played a lot of great games. I've won a lot of great matches in Pokemon. So I want to hear like some of your guys' you know, crowning, I guess you could say crowning achievements, you know? Let me know what you guys are most proud of um, in your life, you know, whether it's, you know, how well you take care of your dog, or how well you do in school, getting straight A's, or if you scored a goal in like a really important game, and I don't know soccer or something like that. Just, just let me know. I want to hear what you know. What, what's your guys' crowning, crowning achievements? You know, I like to celebrate you guys because realistically, this channel is only able to like I only run this channel because there's such great people like you guys who support me, and you know, I, I let's celebrate you guys. Hashtag I don't know, life rocks. True, Abby did that. True, you know, Abby Paul wants on our tickle. <laughs> now we're good. Thanks though. Wait, do we want to learn tickle? Nah, we're good. I just like pictured an Abby Paul tickling me, but like that's kind of weird. All right, <laughs> I don't like actually being tickled. That's actually one of the worst things in the world is being tickled. Uh, wow, Lady Valerie, I need your help. Hello, you can't just go crying to Valerie. It's rude. Uh, no. Passerby Caleb, how about you chill, my boy? All right, all right. So I'm gonna go over here to this one right here because I'm pretty sure, like my strategy is flawless. All right. Is there nobody in here? This is just the bathroom. Okay. I guess they're trying to like say it's not okay to sneak up on a girl in the bathroom. I don't know. <laughs> don't do that. Don't sneak up on a girl in the bathroom, especially when like yeah. Mm-hmm. Hello. This took me back. All right, my my logic was flawed. Okay, but this takes me over here. Uh huh. Interesting. Okay, maybe it's this one. No. Okay. What about this one? Just process of elimination. Okay, this is good. Uh, we haven't been to that room yet. Okay, we haven't battled this girl yet. Okay, hold on. Let me go into my bag real quick. Uh, Crobat, I'm just gonna give you one super potion because we have- Oh, actually, wait. We only have one super potion left. Dang, alright. Well, alright. Oh, no, we're fine. So what do you got? What you got, lady? Don't we look like a bunch of dolls in a dollhouse? Actually, yeah. I thought that was really cool. It's like a, it's like a Barbie dream house. Uh, cleft key. Great, I can't touch this. Wait, can I? Oh, what can it do to me? Is the real question. Let me see if I can, like, how much acrobatics is this thing? Because it's a. Hello, I don't have any moves the same as you. Let's see a poison fang. Alright, let's see how much it does. That actually does respectable damage. I was like, wait, these are in game in game Pokemon. Crobat can build this thing away. Because what's it gonna do to Crobat? Foul play? Oh, shit. Actually, that's a. It's a smart move. Shit, alright, jeez. Alright, have another one. I want you to be like bright powder and I miss and they get foul played to death. Cool. Not really though. Alright. <laughs> We're out of here. Hey. Okay. Okay. Jolteon wants to learn Discharge. However, Jolteon already knows four moves. Should a move be deleted to replace Discharge? Uh, sure. Uh, fuck. Mm, do we want T Wait? Uh, we have T Wait as a TM, so if like I really need it later in the game, I can just teach it to it. Jolteon learned Discharge. A Palm grew to level 16. A Palm grew to level 17. 
Hey, level 24 for Mobile? Okay. About to send out Curlia. Okay, uh, let me swap into Laron here because Laron just walls the hell out of this thing. Let's do it, Laron. Young Stalania. It's time. Okay. Hit her with that iron head. Psychic. We resist that. Yummy. Catch an iron head. Boy. Okay. Anvil wants like fury swipes. That's actually useful. I actually kind of want that. Uh, because... Hmm. Fuck Screech. Because that... Yeah. Because it takes like it takes a turn, and Fury Swipes is more useful. All right, I just send out Gramble. Shit! All right, chill. Actually, we're gonna stay in here. So what's the Gramble gonna do to a Laron? Know what I'm saying? Get his Iron Head and get the Flinch because we have the King's Rock, right? Lick. Okay, don't paralyze me. Aw, that's kind of rude. Can't be paralyzing me out here. That's kind of rude. Rage. It did nothing. It did absolutely nothing. Hurrah! Goodbye, Gramble. Hey. Nice to level up. Level 39. Okay. And Apom grew to level 19, 25 for Moel. Hey, we need to go feed it, girl Blossom. You're no doll, you're a true Pokemon trainer. Hey, I appreciate that. I am a Pokemon trainer. I'm out here to whoop some ass. I'm gonna drink my milk and beat some ass. And I just finished my milk. Alright. <laughs> that's, that's such a corny joke. Don't ever, don't ever tell people that. <laughs> Actually, you can. It's kind, of, it's kind of a funny joke, to be honest. I like it. Oh. I'm a corny kind of man, alright? Don't judge me. I, I hate to use Cyber Potions, but like, it's like... Ruining my OCD that these aren't at full HP. I could use fresh water. I'm a fool. Alright, well, either way. Watch this not be the right one. Okay, this is fine, because I think this girl just leads us to the next girl, uh, into Valerie's room. Alright. Did you know that certain type of moves have no effect against our beloved fairy type Pokemon? Uh, yeah, it's actually dragon type moves. Well, and Klefki's, uh, poison as well, so. Slurpuff. Alright, you can catch a poison fang. Wait, oddly enough, we don't have a... Whatchamacallit? We don't have a dragon type on our team. Hunk. Draining kiss. It's kind of rude. What if I needed that HP, alright? You're getting too KO'd by this poison fang anyway, so it's, it's irrelevant, alright? Stupid cupcake. Hey, 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 get him out of here. Buster's grew to level 45, Empom grew to level 20, Mobile grew to level 26, Noish Noish. Wants to learn Faith Attack. Um, uh, what are we rocking with right now? Taunt, Bite, Fairy Wind, and Astonish. I mean, fuck Astonish, to be honest. Because Astonish does have a chance to flinch, but meh. Hey, we defeat the fusion girl. There are some trainers of moves that are very strong against fairy types, though. That's true. Like poison types, steel types. Um, poison types, steel types, and that's it, right? It's the only two typings that are super effective against... Well, unless they have a secondary typing, so like Earthquake, super effective against uh, Klefki. Hey, and then we're here at Valerie. So if you guys are excited for us to take on the gym leader, make sure you hit the like button like I said at the beginning of the episode. But, uh, we're gonna take her on. It's time. Alright, do the work, Robat. Yo, I kinda like her, like, her kawaii eyes. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer. So, you've flown all the way through my gym, fluttering down to me on a fortune wind. Then I suppose you'd have earned yourself the right to battle as a reward for your efforts. I am Valerie, who leads the fairy-type gym, 
I hope your visit will provide entertaining or will prove entertaining to you. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze and delicate as a bloom, but they are strong. True. Have you seen Azumarill? Next is my boy Blizzes. Alright. She has a Mawile. Okay. So basically walls my poison type moves but I, I still have acrobatics so let's, let's hit her with an acrobatic see how much this does because you didn't have intimidate okay that's a three hit ko i can respect that Hang. all right she's munching up on me she likes she likes the nice cooked a nice cooked uh crobat yeah oh geez okay oh i got a crit oh <laughs> i was surprised we killed that like that easily Alright, there we go. Nice level 45. Alright, uh, Jolteon Grid level 38. Apom Grid level 21. And she's about to send that. This, this is what I was talking about. Mr. Mime is a problem, alright. Uh, let me switch. And we'll bring out young Stalia out here. Let's go, grow power! Girl power! Alright, Mr. Mime. Who do you think you are? Stella is about to teach you... Reflect. That's actually that's actually smart, to be honest. And now she eats that. And then, what, what is her last Pokemon? Is it like a... It's probably Aromatis, right? Aromatis would make sense. Luckily, Laron eats it up. Go Stalinia. But her last Pokemon's gotta be like a Romantis, right? Or maybe oh actually oh it's Sylveon. Shit, this thing's fucking broken. Uh let's keep battling. Let's Stalinia do some work out here, alright? You know what I'm saying? Cause Stalinia is a steel type, so hyper voice Dazzling Gleam? Okay. Ooh, that actually does a lot. Oh, what does this do? That does nothing! Why does that do nothing? <laughs> Alright, girl, back come out here just because you have more, uh... Just because you have a, uh, more HP than Stellanir. And we can kind of saw out the turns of Reflect. Okay, that does nothing to you. That's perfect. Okay. Uh, let me get this nice HP restore up here. Young Fresh Water. Okay, there we go. Perfecto. Swift. Oh wait, she's actually- it looks like she's pixelate boosted because that, that did more damage than I anticipated it to do. But the Reflect I think has one more turn, and then it's gone. So this Poison Fang should do- oh shit, that does a hell of a lot, even though we, the Reflect's not up anymore. Or did the Reflect put down? I don't think it went down. Okay. Well this- oh, she has a higher proportion, okay. Well, let's see how much this does regardless from full. Because I think this is over half, regardless. Or I was wrong. But we do get the poison, fortunately enough. Cute charm. Wait, you're a boy? What? That's some bull. That's some straight up bullshit. Wait, you're not pixelated? You're cute charm? Oh, we should get the poison pank through. Ah! We spit that toxic out of here, you know what I'm saying? All right. Um, I think I can just fresh water up here, to be honest, because I don't want to risk like a crit from like a double edge or something. Because whatever like sneaky move I feel like she has in the back, I don't want it to blow away Crobat. I'm not trying to lose any any team members today. All right. I put. Oh, okay. Okay. So that's how we're doing it. Okay. I see you. Well, regardless of what I did right there. Okay. The reflex definitely not up anymore, right? I must I must have missed it going down. I just wasn't paying attention well enough. But either way. <sighs> Alright, I'm mobilized by love. Lit. Wait, am I still gonna am I like do I not break out of a mobilization? I'm, I'm positive that you break out of a mobilization. Like you're 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 in love no more. Hello? Stop this. Oh, she charmed me before. That's why that poison bank did a lot less that time. Because it falls harshly. Okay. 
But the poison damage is racking up. Uh, I'm just gonna go for a poison fang here. At least it's not like confusion where I can hit myself. Okay, this it's annoying though. It's annoying as hell. I'm surprised she doesn't have a full restore where she can like restore her poison. Oh Jesus, get blown away. Wait, why did that do so much? Like the poison damage doesn't rack up more than more every turn. Or does it for poison fang actually? It might. Yo, Laranger level 40? Wants to learn Iron Tail. Yeah, actually we do want Iron Tail. I like Iron Tail a lot. Because Iron Tail I think is stronger than Iron Head. Yeah. It just has a lower chance to hit. Um Fuck Headbutt. We have King's Rock. Plus we need that steel stab, to be honest. We have strength. Strength is 100% accurate. A bomb grid level 22. Wants to learn Swift. Hello? We got rid of Swift. <laughs> Hello. Stop this. Why do you learn Swift twice? Or it's probably an egg move. Okay. Mawa grid level 28. Perfecto. Hey, and we delivered you to the level or er, later Valerie. I hope the sun is shining tomorrow. That it would be a reason enough to smile. Hey, we get that money? All that money? Hey. Yes, that was a fine battle. I shall reward you for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Its beauty is captivating, is it not? Ah, do forgive me. I was so captivated, I forgot for a moment that it's yours. Hey. Look at this nice looking badge out here. Hey. All right. The captivating fairy badge will endear any Pokemon up to level 80 to you. Even those Pokemon that may receive from others will obey you. I also wish to award you this TM. Please consider it a powerful gift from me, not simply the winnings of a battle. Dazzling Gleam. Ah, Dazzling Gleam. Immaculate. Oh my, what a curious feeling. I can't seem to recall any longer which move is contained in that uh, TM. I hope you might forgive me. My designs are said to be rather mystifying. Don't you agree? I always wanted to be a Pokemon, you see. That desire is my inspiration. And that's what I'm trying to achieve by designing. And yet, the only time I feel when I'm truly a Pokemon is when we're embroiled in a desperate battle. I wonder why that is. Hmm. Could it be? Never mind. It's nothing, kind trainer. Oh, okay. It's kind of weird. Oh, I can see she's trying to be like Sylveon with her eye. Oh. See, I, I'm a little slow, guys, if you haven't noticed by now. Hi, Ace! Who's that? Oh, okay, these these two triggered the event. Awesome. Hey, that's the fairy badge! It's so cute and sparkly! You know what? We're going to tour the Pokeball Factory. Come with us! I'm interested in the Pokeballs because they're used to catch Pokemon. To put it another way, I'm utterly fascinated by them. Cool. Good for you, man. I, you, you do you. I mean, I like Pokeballs, like... I actually wish they would come out with like real type Pokeballs. Well, actually, I have like, I don't know if you, some of you might not be old enough, but uh, Burger King, when I was younger, actually did like an event. Actually, it might have been McDonald's. It, it might have been both, to be honest, because Pokemon was so popular when I was a little kid. But they did like an event where you got golden plated Pokemon, uh, like little uh, things inside a Pokeball. It's actually pretty accurate to the design of a Pokeball, except it's like a little, I don't know, like a pedestal more so than a, uh, than like an actual Pokeball. Like, if you open it up, it holds a little gold plate with a little, uh, like, certificate saying that it's authentic or whatever. But, yeah. I have them all. My, like, my grandpa and grandma, like, used to, and my mom and dad, too, like, used to go, like, every time, like, that's all I would ask for is, like, I was like, can you go to McDonald's or Burger King and get me one of those? And they're like, yeah, sure. I was, like, five or six, like, maybe even, I might have been a little older than that, I might have been, like, eight or nine, but I was just like, that's what I want. And, like, they didn't go buy me toys or anything, that, that's literally what they got me. I got Burger King and that. All right. But now we can go up here and uh, walk up and trigger this nice event to the Pokeball Factory. So I'm pretty sure the order that you have to do it is that you go up to these two and he says, How vexing! He won't let us into the Pokeball Factory. And you talk to Shauna. He'll let us in, you'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Alright. Shauna, wait! And then these two come running down as they're getting chased away. Okay, these two come up, I guess. Did Shauna and Travis go... Oh, oh, did Shauna and Travis go running up just now? What's the deal? We're supposed to meet them here, too. I wonder what's the matter is. Eek! 
Oh, there goes Shauna. Shauna, wait! Stop! Alright, and now we can just really get into the thing. <laughs> oh, oh, what's going on? Well, I guess I'll go help them. Team Flare? There might be something happening inside. Let's go check out what the guard has gone. Okay, but we will actually do that next episode, I believe. Mm. Actually, wait. The only, the, the only other thing that I want to be able to do is to get a Wonder Trade Pokemon. So, am I allowed to go... Hold on. Am I allowed to go on the next route? Or is this blocked off still? It is still blocked off by Team Flare. Okay. Hello. Fuck off. Alright. But we will, uh, we finished the fairy gym today. So we will go into the Pokeball factory next episode, actually, and take on, uh, all the Team Flare members and get our nice reward. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna wait right here by Serena. Young girl. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Hope you enjoyed.